Welcome to a very hot and steamy Campbellsville University practice room. Now our guest today is considered one of the best Kentucky wrestlers that's ever passed through our great commonwealth. Sir, if you would, tell us who you are. David Carr, um, you know, in Kentucky, you know, the Carr family name is is definitely prevalent and, uh, you know, Cousin Joe, Uncle Joe, um, my Uncle Joe was the first coach at University of Kentucky when they had wrestling, so definitely um, our name has been uh, synonymous with Kentucky. And you are the 2014 126 pound state champion from Woodford County. And like he said, uh, JoJo, four time state champion, 93, 95, 96, 97. JoJo's videos are on the channel. Um, Joe Carr Sr. He was the coach with Coach Parks at Woodford County, won multiple state team state championships. Right now, uh, Woodford County is in second place overall with 13 team titles, and they have 64 individual team or ind individual state wrestling champions. But man, you, we'll, we'll talk about your high school as we're joined by the legendary uh, Nate Carr and. Uh, Joe Carbeck, we'll get to those guys just in a second. But what gets you into to wrestling outside of, you know, growing up in a household where you had an Olympic medal winning uh, dad? You know, what kind of gets you into it? Like, what what is like, I want to do this? Well, I just, I always had like wrestling shoes growing up. I actually mm -hmm. started a little bit late. I started wrestling in fifth grade. That was my first year. And uh, I just came to a few practices. I remember my dad was just saying, hey, you want to come to practice? And I would just do the warm up for a little while and just do the, you know, gymnastics, the rolls. Right. And then once I had kind of made some friends on the team, some younger guys that are my age, um, they were like, how come you're not wrestling? I was like, I don't know. And uh, I was like, yeah, let's go try some tournaments. And my mom actually took me my, like, first ever wrestling tournament. I think my dad was, like, out of town commentating or Oh, something. really? So my mom coached me up, and I qualified for the state tournament. I didn't place, and just continue to get better from there. Hey. Man, we got to start. And that's something, too, that a lot of um, guys we've done the video series with, like dad was a coach, uncle, grandpa was a coach. And I'm not saying the better wrestlers, but the more, like, that the youngsters were allowed to just explore and find it on their own is the guys that seem like they've developed a love for it and they stick with it instead of being forced. You are going to wrestle. You are going to have a choice. And they get through it, but they like, man, I hated it. But like, like you said, you just kind of found it and you have obviously stuck with it. Now, we're gonna talk about your Kentucky in just a second, but after you leave, you go back to Ohio, correct? And if I'm not mistaken, you win four state championships. Mm, yeah. That's, so a four-timer in, a, what division was that? So my first year as a freshman was division three, which is like a little bit like the smaller schools, but there's like a good handful of guys that are pretty tough at my weight. Mm -hmm. So I won it at 138 and then uh, I wrestled, moved to uh, Maslin Perry, where my dad was my coach. Okay. And then I won three state titles in Division One, and I had a lot of good wrestlers. Like I wrestled Dominic Demas, who wrestled at Oklahoma, he's All American. Oh my. Um, he so that was my state finals match. He was a state champ. I was a state champ, and so I wrestled him my sophomore year, junior year. I wrestled Jaden Ka or Jaden Maddox, mm -hmm. and he was. A state champ as well. So every year I had a state he champ. Had a full to Ohio state. He had a full ride to Ohio State. Yep. So each year I wrestled state champs in the finals, basically. Oh my. Even in Kentucky, I wrestled Trey Blackwell. Was yeah, Trey, two time two state time champion. champion. Now, of yeah. um, course, uh, Nate was a 1988 bronze medalist. He's right there behind us. Uh, Goodwill Games 1990 bronze or gold medal and the 1986 World Cup gold medal. So, and then. Um, Coach Carr, what was it? You were the, uh, was it Goodwill Games or World yeah, Cup? Goodwill Games champions. Was that? Good, uh, Pan Am. Pan Am. Pan Am Games. Pan Am. Okay. So silver medal winner. The silver medal in and the Pan junior, Am Games. Junior World Silver Medal winner. And Junior World's Silver Medal. So, I mean, the Carr, the Carr family, uh, not just in Kentucky, not just in Pennsylvania, but across the, the United States is known, I mean, as one of the best generational um jojo in his video said that he has a win over kel sanderson in a freestyle event 
And I was like, oh my gosh, you know, that's saying something. Now, I bring up Cal Sanderson because where did wrestling take you after, you know, there's a very famous Iowa State wrestler named Cal. Now, where did you go? Refresh our memory. I was there. I was there. There we go. There we go. Dan Gable's Iowa State. And Dan Gable. So, and how did your Iowa State career, how did it go? So, I have one year left, but um, so far it's been pretty good. Um, there's a lot of rest, lot of wrestling good. legend. <laughs> pretty good. Yeah, pretty good. So. De- define pretty good. I'm a four-time Big 12 champion. Okay. National champion. Na- uh, NCAA runner-up last year. Um, so yeah, and three-time All-American if you're counting COVID. Four-time All-American. So that's why I was gonna say the COVID year. So I would yeah. consider that, a, which coming from the Car Dynasty, the Car Legacy. Uh, if, if, I guess if you don't win at least once, you're like, man, I, ugh, but no, man. National champion, Tucky Wrestling has two Division One NCAA champions, you and uh, Mark Hall at Penn State. Of course, Mark wrestled one year at Raw. He came up a little bit short as a seventh grader in 2010, but still two Division One champions. You did it. You won this Tucky State as an eighth grader. Now, of course, we have your video, but before we get to the video, let's go over your bracket real quick. Got it pulled up here. The first round, you wrestle Brian Safar from Campbell County. You win a 6-3 to three decision over that. The second round, you wrestle Caleb Austin from Christian County. You win a very close 5-4 to four decision. On, over, was it overtime? It, it, it doesn't say, but we'll, we'll give you the overtime on that. Um, the quarterfinals, you're wrestling Nathan Lopez. Mm-hmm. From Harrison County, you win that by a fall in a minute, 57 seconds. Mm-hmm. Semifinals, Elijah Owens, Simon Kenton. Yeah. You win an eight to two decision. So that gets you into the finals. And you're wrestling two-time defending state champion from Union County, Trey Blackwell. And I think Trey goes on to, was it Oklahoma? Oh, yeah, Oklahoma. That's, okay, that's what I thought. And, of course, uh, you know, Union County, if you're not familiar, if, the, if uh, David's video brings you to the channel, Union County. Uh, has become a powerhouse. Woodford County in the 80s, 90s, early 2000s were, was the best program in the state, and it wasn't even close. You had guys like Chris Dunn, Ian Horn, JoJo Carr. You had um, Josh Whitaker, Joshua Campbell. I mean, I could go on and on and on and on with these guys' names. And most of these guys are already on the channel, but Union County, they come storming in, and they, they uh, you know, your Brock Irvins, your Micah Irvins, your Matthias Irvins, just all the Irvins, um, Jace Carr, Payne Carr, all these guys that come, no relation to you guys, I don't think anyway, no. uh, Payne and Jace, but the Union County and Woodford County are two of the best programs in Kentucky history. Now, we have your video. We're, has it been a long time since you've seen it? or? Yeah, it's been a while. Been a while. Yeah. All right, so we're going to get our computer set. We're going to go back to 2014 to the horse park. We'll see you guys there. What we're seeing, we've been joined by, uh, we got Big car. We got Nate right My here, dad. Olympian. We got, is it Jojo, Joe Junior. Jr., right? Yeah. Double Joe. Du- Double Junior. We got, you guys have seen Jojo before, his four. And yeah. we got Coach ball. Carr right here. So we've got, we got enough cars here to have a parking lot. Uh, <laughs> so we're going to go back to, to 2014. Let's go, man. You ready? Yeah. Let's do it. Strong in Ohio. Saint X is a and you got Coach Parks on the call. Runner up a year ago, Campbell County, third place, Union County. And so you're an eighth grader. Are you right are you nervous? Big crowd. Yeah. What we what we what we thinking here? I don't know. I I, I was probably pretty nervous. I've never, uh, course, uh, we'll see there's Trey. Of course, also you had uh, Nathan Boston in the finals right, with you yeah, and uh, Tucker Hurst. Mm-hmm. David Carr, the third Woodford County wrestler out of the first four matches. I was definitely fired He's up. Ready. Yeah, He's ready. I was Second fired up. County wrestler of the evening. Two it's funny because Jojo, Jojo told Trey me exactly Blackwell. what he's going to do, slide by, and he gets it right away. So, Blackwell comes out and does comes out, gets a pretty quick takedown on you. Robot yeah. Right off the bat for a takedown on Carr. You're able, we're out. Good start. Yeah. You got Katan. A lot of energy. And I can't tell who the other uh, referee is. I'll Blackwell. check here in a second. Yeah, so a lot of energy, excited. You know, I, I know he's a good opponent. Yep. Try to come out. Just firing. 
giving up that wrist easy. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like, oh, he's, yeah. like he's trying for like a cradle right there, but you're oh. you're not you're not giving that up. I believe your record says you were 47 and one. Yeah, so I I, I lost that like the I don't even know what that turn oh, was. Oh, the round, turn. Rumble. Oh, the yeah. Raider Rumble. Raider, Raider yeah. Rumble, and uh, yeah, I was wrestling an Ohio kid. I was actually up like four one, and then I went up her body and got pinned. Oh, did you? Along, yeah. want to talk about the so that was a good yeah, loss. It just taught me what to do and learn different things. That was nice. Just a cut base. I, I, I do like pressure. a little limp Almost leg little. thing, I think. Now, Maybe like, not. Like we said, you're an eighth grader. Trey is a senior looking for his third state championship. I think he was ranked One minute fourth left in the nation. Period. Right, I think yeah. fourth in the nation, we believe. At this point right here. Mm -hmm. Looks like he's putting on a good ride, just trying to get out. Yep. I like to go, like, it's not good. I would, like, reach back and, like, Hip forward and limp mm -hmm. my leg out because my like have pretty like flexible knees. But switch. Sorry, I switched there. Nothing good. Go back. I don't even remember being this bad on bike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you could, like you could totally. Oh, 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 almost. Uh oh, almost. Uh oh. Oh, no, you should get the reverse. No. One. I almost got yeah. Get your one. one. All right, that wasn't bad. And I believe you've got uh, I Joe got and Joe Joe in, in your corner. Oh, that was oh, nice. Ooh, it's that leg trip. 30 seconds left oh. in the opening period. Oh, oh look at that. Oh, he's got black ball on his back. That was a good wow. magic right wow. there. Wow. <laughs> did, did you teach him that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I remember. Left, you remember period. I remember um, we went over that practice where he's That's like, hey, weird. he does like this little thing. Like, he gets a lot of people and pins him with it. And look how tight that is. You didn't pin him? No. Two points for Carr. So, uh, three, comedy's two. free today, guys, on the channel. <laughs> I, know, I don't think my dad's even seen this Good job by Blackwell to work off of his back there. Yeah, All right, so you get a big swing right there. Oh, my yeah. goodness. 6'2". Looking very yep. sharp here. You get a big, and it just shows you it was a, they, they were in a little less. scramble right <laughs> there. The time and the came now. up on top. Golly. So he's, he's still dizzy. He's going to take neutral, which kind of surprised me when I was editing. Blackwell yeah, I, I remember him doing neutral. I think... I was squeezing his head so tight he wasn't really thinking about it and just decided to go, I got go you. up, to be oh, honest. Good county people here as well. Just trying mm -hmm. to slide off the hips for sprawl. Oh, nice. Car's got a front oh, it looks so Let's tiny. My muscles didn't come in the mail yet, so. Great position. Ted Kitts with a barrel roll. Oh, yep. Blackwell is about mm -hmm. to turn the tide nope. here. Wow, nope, so nope, this, nope. These kids are both very talented, very talented. It's move, counter, move. He trying to look for that slide by again. Yeah. Crowd comes to life. Yeah, we always want to see that replay how you turn them over. So you're you're hand fighting with him. Again. What is like your best David takedown at, at this stage of your wrestling here. career that you remember? I honestly I did like a to go sometimes in the I do a six slide by. We're at we're neutral. And I think so Rusty, I, I think a lot of people are heading into like this championship trick. matches. Slide by, really I do a single leg, and I do like a fake snap knee tack. Really and I was like, okay. oh, yeah, I got you. Those are so. my three so. moves I'm trying to hit. I get that fish hook and wrist, fake. And he still does. He still does a little. So those are kind of like my my main motions. He's kind of strong, so it was hard. There's a slide by, it didn't work. Oh, oh, but. And you know, even though Cars had a great record, he hadn't wrestled Blackwell this year, so you just really don't know how they would match up and how the the youth versus the uh, the seniority of a Blackwell would would go. But so we're about saying. thirty seconds left, about thirty five left to go in the second okay period. Right now at six to two with about nobody's really got to, Ooh, nobody scored yeah. yet. Oh, 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 did he get taken? Yeah. yeah. Two. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I know that was a bad, that was a good takedown. And I think that was. Joe, <laughs> Joe, what did you say there? Yeah. Yeah. That's it, son. You can't be relaxed. Six four lead. I think probably said don't relax. 26 seconds to go, second period. Six seconds. It's going to be important. 26 seconds. I can't remember if I got away or not. Did I get away? Uh, I knew, yeah, I knew, look, he, I knew that he was tough on bottom, but we were up six four, so we had to go down. Oh look, blue is close. Wow. Oh, this is the, wow. it is the end of, end of the period first. Black I think he does ride me out. Jeopardy. Dude, this is actually really bad. This part, oh, you, right you there, not want to watch. Wow. Watch this. Watch this. He like almost puts me on my back. Wow, you should be like Billy Five, Billy down. Billy down. Uh oh. Oh my. What are we doing? 
Is that point? Ooh. Well, he got two. He I think he got a two count, count didn't he? Did One's zero. One zero. Zero. Okay, zero. Okay, nope. Uh, what well, so far. That's what I saw. Alright, so start. <laughs> I told you. No <laughs> time. Whoa, so, man. It looks like bad boys to me. So there's there's uh, Cousin Joe coming out and Uncle Joe to kind of calm you down. Uncommon here in the <laughs> Look at Joe. What are you saying, bro? You're letting him have it. He's like, yeah. <laughs> oh, you better not lose it. <laughs> I was probably oh, talking about why do you eat Billy Dale. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I was, and that, I think that's uh, Rusty. Young, young Rusty, right? Yeah, yeah, I was definitely should have belly down. That was something that I kind of learned that. How did Young Rusty get out there? He's ran So, he, you're, you're taking down. And you're up six to four. There is, if he can escape, he's got a three point lead, and the takedown will not tie or beat him. So, it's going to be a. Really I honestly was like, to work to I was trying to get out, but I was really trying to make sure I don't go to my back here, belly down again, and I was just killing time. Really, just killing time. I don't, I didn't think he was gonna be able to turn me, but shoot. Off the mat. we're out. Off the mat, a minute forty-two left in the match. And like, this is the number four ranked kid in the right nation in the great that great you're up on late or well in, in the third trail, period. Trailing six four. He started car, the next year at Oklahoma, County. Yeah. He started? Yeah. yeah. He's tough. So he's trying to, that's like his, that little tilting is good. And he's good at that. Damn. I can, no, I can get my wrist away. seconds to go. I mean, he's a lot stronger. I didn't have any muscles. So I, I, it was hard, really hard to like, to work yeah, to it was hard to get some stuff off. If you wrestled him again, you'd beat him. And the pressure's on Blackwell. He's <laughs> I beat him here. here or, no, I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, you beat him again, too. <laughs> so, like, right here, I'm honestly thinking, I'm just like, dude, I just want, I'm just waiting for the clock to run out. Look at me looking at the clock. I'm like, dude, you can go ahead and do all this stuff. That's what I was just thinking. I was just like, probably wasn't the best thing, but I was just like, trying to get out again. Turn. He needs a limp leg and try to face him to get his one here. He's there. Okay, so you are. Oh, jeez. Oh, no, no takedown. No takedown. Right it it should have been two. About that. Yep. Oh, he got two. Yep. Yeah, he should have got two. He gave, gave you that wow. reversal right there. No, two. they waved it off. Huh? Watch. Look, see, I'm lining up. Oh, no. no Joe, Joe said, Katane said neutral. I told you. I told you. It should have been two. Who's that red? Yeah, he's supposed to be quiet. Joe Katan. Joe Katan. Where's Mark? Joe Katan. So you're up three points, about 25 seconds left. David Blackman would have hit like Taylor. I think probably his best strategy would be to, to shoot in and get a leg. Hold on. Oh, 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 oh. I know. I kept trying to do that little slide, but I think that was not working at all. What? It worked. I had hit it a lot in, during the year. It worked. <laughs> Back when, look at Trey. Trey looked like an unbelievable. Oh, yeah. You don't know what he's happened. He's dizzy. Yeah, it looks like he's stuck. Ten mm. seconds. Ten seconds to go. Boy, this will be a shocker, Rusty. Be a shocker, and Rusty. Match has come to a close. Wow. And there you go, wow. man. And the this match also grader, has the middle. This video has the, the, the um, middle the ceremony. Right there. Jeez. And a shocker here. Now I will say I've watched Trey Blackwell wrestle. Mm -hmm. David Carr. Because I was a total. I think I was busy. Was and so I was like, man, I don't know if he's a big guy. For the two -time <laughs> and then I heard he beat him. But what a shot right there. You go over, shake hands with the Urbans. Uh, and then, and the best part impressive. of the video, do much better than that. Uncle so Joe that picks was, you up. Yeah, that That's was very impressive. impressive. Very impressive. Joe wants nothing to do with it. Like, yeah, he's, he's like, like get on, man. <laughs> he's like, it's like, you got to put on your back. What are we doing? <laughs> and Nick Cudd picks up here with the uh, the medal ceremony. So, you come off the mat, you just beat number four ranked kid in the nation. State champion for Woodford County. What are you thinking? Uh, this is definitely one of the most special. Out of all my state titles, this one is definitely one of the most special ones just because no one really thought it. Like, no one in the stadium thought I was going to win. Mm -hmm. I think they coached me up pretty well of, like, what to do. Uh, so I, I believe that, you know, if I stick to the game plan, I knew I could win and, and, and be aware of things. But So definitely when I won, I was just like, this is crazy. Like this is all the hard work paid off. Oh, that guy was tough. I had a lot of tough matches. Yeah. We had like 
two overtime matches or something. Mm. Right? Hey, Didn't you see him in the I'm last sure duel? I mean, no. in the last tournament. tournament. Yeah. Last tournament. Uh, There's Trey. Here, here you are Trey. taking your, like your rightful in. place. And a great Do you still have your beginning. state medal? Kentucky State Medal. Yeah. 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 And uh, like we saw Irvin just win five in a row. There it is, man, on top well. of the top of the world. First of first of many. Look at that deer. He's like, I don't want nothing to do with this, man. David I'm on I'm on the even side. I won't be on. That's who I wrestled in the yeah, second round. round. So he he got second. He was a, the guy in fourth. He got second last year in the Trey like well, real close match. Oh really? And then so he was he was kind of the top seed. Him and and you beat him. Yeah, that's why I wrestled. That's why I beat, I beat him in overtime. I was winning, and I, Joe was like, don't back up, don't back up. I think I took like one step back. There's two seconds left. They called me a stalling. Oh, oh, no way. Oh, that was horrible. Who was that guy? So, watching it back, does it play out the way you remember? Oh, coming across. Huh? No, go, go, Okay, well, I thought we, uh, so does it play out, though, the way you remember it? Yeah, I just. Other than you winning. Um. I definitely don't. I didn't remember like the first few periods. I always remember like the end. I always remember like the end being like how it was. Where I I remember reaching back bad, which is also just a good lesson. It didn't cost me too much, uh, luckily. But I remember like okay, don't do that. Um, there were some things that I just learned that helped me get a lot better. Right. Um, and continue to get better. But that was definitely one of the most meaningful state titles, and I remember just being like so happy because that's the goal. Like I'm. Got to Kentucky. I wanted to win a state title, and I knew I had someone who was going to be tough. He already had a full ride yep. to Oklahoma. He's a lot stronger. Just was a good wrestler, and so the overcome and win was definitely. Now, did you being at Iowa State? That's Big Twelve too. They're both Big Twelve. Did you like? I'm not saying match up with him, but was he at meets where you were at, or? No, he had been. I know he started Lord. his first year. He might have been done by the time I. Okay. Because yeah, okay. I was only in eighth grade. grade and oh, he's that, a that's senior, right. That's, so. What am I thinking? By the time, I, by time I was there, he had already graduated. But I know. So one of the guys that went to Oklahoma that I was friends with that was like, dude, we were like messing with them in the locker room. Like, how'd you lose this on eighth grade? And then as I, once I, like my freshman year, sophomore year, I started to get a lot better. I was winning like Ironman, all these big tournaments. Mm -hmm. He's like, I told you that kid was good. <laughs> like, I told you, man. Like, you guys, this dude's like basically Mark Hall. Like, I told you. I just yeah. lose to some random kid, like he's good, and so I remember he told. I ran into him at some tournament. I don't know if he was coaching or something, but he was like, "Yeah, they were giving a hard time," and then I was like, well, "Look, he literally just won Super Two or something like that." Like hey, I told him, and you tell them, "Hey, anytime that you want to shot the title, right? Step up, right?" Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Well, man, thank you for being here today, taking yeah. time from the. If you hear some background noise, the uh, the camp is going on below us. We're here in the, uh, I guess the upper deck part of the um, facility here at Campbellsville. It's the FCA camp this week, so thank you guys for letting me come, and thank you to the entire uh, Carr family. I mean, a lot, uh, lot of wrestling tradition right here behind us, Kentucky, national, world level, and it's just great that you guys want to take part in this, and you guys really appreciate what we're doing for Kentucky well, well, thank wrestling. Thank you. You do a very good job. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Thank you. I really, thank you. really appreciate that. So, from 2014 at the Horse Park, Mr. Carr, that's all we have. We'll see you guys on the mat.